What's up, everybody? It's Trent from Trent Tendo, and we're back, and we've got a bunch of news, a bunch of rumors, a bunch of speculation, and some pretty good stuff from people in the know that we might have a Nintendo Direct coming as soon as next week, and even potentially getting something else again in July. That's right, two summer Nintendo Directs that we have got to talk about. So make sure you hit that subscribe button, like this video, so you're kept up to date with everything going on here at Trent Tendo. We're gonna bring you guys the latest and greatest of everything Nintendo. You're not gonna wanna miss anything this summer as it sets up to be something that could be something very, very special for Nintendo as we look forward to potentially a new console and saying goodbye to the Nintendo Switch. So, as I mentioned, we've got a bunch of stuff that has been circulating around suggesting that we could get a Nintendo Direct as early as next week. Now, first off, you do have to take everything with a grain of salt, you know, and nothing is ever set in stone until Nintendo says so. But the people that are talking are people that typically have, you know, some good information. These aren't just your typical leakers and, you know, Samus hunters and people chasing clout. This isn't just a bunch of you know, stuff on like a, on like Reddit or, you know, 4chan, stuff like that. This is pretty good stuff. Now, as I mentioned, uh, comes from people in the know. The first person that we got to talk about is someone that we've talked about quite a bit on the channel, Nate the Hate. Now he's, you know, he's been known to leak things a lot. He definitely has people in the know and, you know, he hasn't been 100% correct, but, you know, typically when he speaks, you know, he does have some solid information. It's not just someone who's throwing something out there that hopes it's going to stick. Now, he's posted a bunch of stuff, you know, about a potential Nintendo Direct. And he even said something that, to the effect that he would not rule June out. You know, a lot of people thinking that June was going to be a no-go with Nintendo dropping E3. But Nate's saying here that, you know, I wouldn't rule this out. And then even he goes as far to, to vote on a family board poll, showing us that he voted for June as the Nintendo Direct. And then he responded to a fan's question, you know, someone asking about, I think it was Last Dragon or something. I can't remember, to be honest. Um, but he, he responds that to the question of someone asking what the percentage he thinks we will see of, of this game in Nintendo Direct. And he responded with 6.21%, you know, heavily hinting at 621, which is next Friday, if I'm not mistaken. So one week from today, which would be you know, much sooner than a lot of people anticipated. So he's saying that there's a bunch of other stuff going around, you know. Uh, there are some people that are throwing stuff out there, you know, from your, your Reddits and your 4chans and things like that, where they're saying that it could be this next week. Uh, but, after, you know, after that, the bigger other, the bigger other thing, I think, um, is what happened last night. Now, I was listening to uh, Jeff Grubb's Game Mess. Him and Mike Minotti were talking about Summer's Games Fest, you know, what their experience was. And someone sent a super chat in there asking about when he thinks there could be Nintendo Direct. You know, Jeff had gone, kind of gone on the record saying that he'd heard rumblings of July, uh, something that was going to be happening in July. And someone asked him about, you know, what he thought about potentially seeing a Direct this next week and or if it was going to be still be in July, you know. And Jeff actually said that he could see something happening both. You know, he, he's heard things that, yeah, he could see a Direct happening next week and again in July. The question is, is what kind of Direct is this? You know, are we actually going to get a full-fledged general Direct next week? Or is that something that's going to come out in July? You know, maybe we just get a partner showcase. You know, he said he did mention that Nintendo is contractually obligated to showcase some of these third-party games uh, in a Direct of some sort, whether it's a third-party showcase or if it's a general Direct. Uh, so we could potentially see something a little bit smaller next week uh, and then something else in July. Maybe that's where we see, you know, the Switch 2 that's been heavily speculated. If we do get something at the end of July, you know, that gives them four or five months run up to the end of the year or first part of next year to, to actually market this thing. So it'll be interesting to see what happens. Uh, but it does seem like, you know, where there's smoke, there's fire and there's definitely... Uh, smoke coming suggesting that there is something on the horizon for Nintendo whether that's next week or whether that's July uh, the good news is we're not gonna have to wait all that long um, and as I'm talking it you know it's going to be interesting to see what happens I'm just kind of thinking what Nintendo might do uh, could we see you know the heavily rumored game uh, GameCube ports whether that's thousand year door uh, 
Legend of Zelda Wind Waker, Twilight Princess, you know, there's a ton of stuff out there that we haven't actually seen yet that has been heavily rumored for some time. So it'll be interesting to see what happens, you know, if Nintendo does this soon, if this is a third party, if it's a general, uh, but it does definitely seem like something is coming down the pipeline here soon. And we're not gonna have to wait that much longer until we hear something official from Nintendo. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks again for watching. I um, appreciate it. And like I said, we're excited to be here at Trentendo, uh, bringing you guys the latest and greatest on Nintendo and what they're doing. So hope you enjoyed. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, like this video. It really does help. And until next time, catch you later.